Yo, what's up, people? Twilly's Two Cents here, back with another video for you guys. I got a review today of an Argos fragrance, one of the most popular. You may already know what it is, you may not. Let's jump into it. Welcome back to the video. So, today, not gonna keep you guys long we're gonna jump right into it like i said this fragrance is coming from the house of argos one of the most popular from the band from the brand and that is known as triumph of bacchus so this fragrance right here was released in the year 2019 and it was perfumed by christian petrovich so let's quickly go over this presentation as you can notice man argos makes some great bottle presentations very hefty glass you know metal caps this gold got the little diamond with the uh eye of ores on top of there and man the just the immaculate detailing on this plaque that's on the front you know haven't really looked into you know what the photo or you know painting or whatever you want to call it means or where it came from all i know is that this is just stunning a stunning bottle one of the best looking bottles in my collection and this right here is a 30 mil size i don't need 100 mils at this point i have a lot of fragrances in my collection but yeah to me i just like the size and everything about this bottle right here you do have argos across the bottom that's kind of, you know, not embossed, but like sticking out of the glass. And yeah, man, just look at that color juice. It's like a dark peachy type of color, which I will mention something about peach when I get into the notes. Man, take this top off, atomizer. Good pressurized atomizer. And smell, man. Let's go ahead and jump into the notes. So with this fragrance right here up top, you're going to get some saffron some white peach, green apple, and rum notes. In the mid we have some patchouli, jasmine, tonka bean, and vetiver. In the base we have some tobacco, amber, sandalwood, musk, and vanilla. So, a few things about this fragrance right here. Of course, you may have heard, this fragrance right here kind of resembles, you know, Mancero's red tobacco. With that, I have to agree. But is it 100% Mancera red tobacco? I would say, nah, it's probably like 75 to 80% resemblance. But this one right here does something different from red tobacco. So if you know anything about red tobacco, that is a beast of a fragrance. Can be kind of hard to wear sometimes. And also smells awesome when that sillage hits the wind. With this fragrance right here, don't get me wrong, it's not a slouch. But this one is more wearable, it's more suitable, and definitely you're going to get the same experience from the sillage with this one too. The note that really stick out in the opening of this fragrance is that fruity peach note. As you get into the mid and the dry down of this fragrance, it becomes a tad bit more spicy. The tobacco and the vanilla sticks out. And what you get overall with this one is a very you know, creamy, smooth, well-balanced type of a fragrance. Now one thing that I can say that this kind of you know puts me in a mind frame of and it's not a bad thing so when I say this don't take it the wrong way just imagine you know what those original Carmex or chapstick uh, things smell like you know a slight bit of menthol in it but if you can imagine you know that Carmex or the chapstick you kind of get that experience with this right here like I said it's not off-putting so I don't mean to make it sound that way but you will definitely if you have smelled this one you will know what I'm talking about but like I said a combination of the fruits in this the tobacco the warmness creamy smooth just a great you know fragrance situations that you might wear this in of course they nice of course formal events stuff like that can't be just white t-shirt with this one although you can't i wouldn't do it that way because you're gonna be out there making a statement with this fragrance so you might as well make a statement with your outfit as well so what we have right here is a very classic elegant fragrance you know kudos to argos for putting out something that's amazing and if i had to give this thing right here a rating i'm giving it a 9.0 on the recommendation scale so in closing if you're looking for something fantastic to wear you know this fall winter 
definitely sample this one check it out yeah if you see it catch it i know this one right here tends to sell out fast so whenever you see it you know you might want to pull the trigger on that one so have you tried argos's you know triumph of bacchus if you did let me know in the comments what has been your experience are you looking to try it? you know just chop it over me in the comments yeah i would like to take this moment to say i appreciate all of you guys who have subscribed to this channel more content will continue coming you guys' way. I thank you all for rocking with me. Yeah, I'll catch you in the next video. Peace. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you haven't subscribed yet, please go ahead and subscribe. Click the notification bell. And if you enjoyed the video, also leave me a like or dislike. Drop some comments. You know, stuff like that. And also, check out one of these videos.